Hey, what's up everyone? Okay, so in this video, I'm gonna show you how to add a hyperlink to an image. And the reason I'm doing this is because I needed to make a tweak on something someone sent me. Um, it's a guide on getting your first thousand fans on Facebook, teaches you how to do it, but this is about making something like this a clickable link. So you've probably uploaded an image onto your pages and you know you right click and you try to find something to add a hyperlink you might have even gone edit and or what is it insert and then link or wherever it actually is format add link and it doesn't work so the workaround here is very simple uh, you go to text and you'll see here a text box pops up and what I like to do is I just figured this out so I'll make this the same exact size or around the same size as this button and then we'll shrink this a little just so it matches. We'll drag this down. And what we're gonna do here is this here is uh, eyes appear to be the easiest to make this work. I'm actually gonna change the color of this so you can see it a little better. So we'll make, let me add the hyperlink elsewhere just so it's easy for me to track. Okay, so right now we're making this full of eyes and eyes just happens to be the easiest to make sure it stays for the full thing and what you can do is just duplicate that so that way you're not just endlessly scrolling on stuff and what we'll do here is this means that this whole area will be a clickable link right so we'll go back and we'll get to the actual page that we were using we'll double click on this to make sure all of the text is highlighted and if we right click and go to add link and then go to web page, that's where you'll paste the actual link and then just click out of it. After that, what I like to do is you'll see up here at the right, there's a format. And if you go to style, there's opacity or opacity, whatever it's called. And if you just make it invisible, you take it down to zero and you can drag that over on top of the button that you had. I'll delete this and we'll export, you can see here there's that little button here that shows something's under it. If we go to file and export, we'll export this. And then I'll open it up to show you how it works. Okay, so go to the bottom of the report, you want access, click here, and you'll see that the little hyperlink is fully there and it works to redirect to the page that I wanted them to. So if you have any questions or anything, let me know down below. Thanks for watching and be sure to subscribe for more videos.